Pepe Manu. I'll be starting in a second. I'm just grabbing coffee. I need it to death. I'm re officially the first here. Right, I have obtained coffee, we can begin. I should put my glasses on before my eyes start itching. I almost forgot. I almost forgot at work as well. I was there for like an hour, wondering why my eyes felt funny. And the guy who sits across from me goes, Oh, are you not wearing your glasses today? I said, That'll be why then. Right. Where were we? Oh, we were in the freaky clinic and coffee, coffee in my mug from my guild when I used to play Warcraft. This is the wrong save. I am good. I get to work from home tomorrow. I get to have an early finish from work. And then I'm off for two weeks. Yeah, this is the the character I used to get platinum on this game. It's got tentacles. Yeah, they, my glasses are more for high strain than anything else. Now to go on to the actual save. But yeah, sometimes I forget and I sit there wondering why my eyes feel itchy and they're all watery and horrible. Right. Online. And I need to load the right one. There we go. Bofa. Yeah. It's not like... When I wanted to get the, when I was looking at this game, looking at the trophies and everything for it, I realised I only needed three to get the platinum. I needed the two other endings for the game, and I needed to collect some weapons. So those two, I basically ran the entire game as fast as I could to get the other two endings, and then I went and ground out all the weapons on that one. And yeah, the attacks are gross. You can throw up on people, you can, you can throw maggots at them as well. Dirty great maggots. Now for the actual save I was using, where we can run around the creepy clinic again. Ta-da! Oh, weapon at risk. I need to go and repair. That's what I forgot to do last time. I knew there was something. How have you both been today than any? Have you had good days? I have been uh, making a couple of plans for my time off. I also need to resend my new parcel. Right, weapon is fixed. I've also been keeping up with my exercise routine. I walked almost two kilometers today and then fell down and felt like I was dying at the end of it. Right, 
So we've been up these stairs and everything. We need to go up the elevator, don't we? We've got you who wants Hello? brain juice. Please, I'm Hello, please. Please, Bunny, I must have it without it. So she wants more brain fluid. Give it a bud. Give me the lift. I need to work out how to get to the top. And because of the weird way that the floor requests work, I'm just going to use the item that she gives us straight away. So this is the room with the old man. I bore it. is out there. So do I need to go up another one? Let's go straight to the top now. Just... How have you been Bart? Crazy man. I'm all right. <gasps> it's here. Oh, I hit these things. I was getting everything set up at work today as well for my two weeks off and we realised that we've not got anybody who can actually cover the email inbox that I work so it's just gonna sit there and have nothing done for two weeks we got here we have rats items crow Crazy person. Have you got more brain juice? I need more brain juice. Brain juice, you're rubbish. Right. Where are we gonna find this brain juice? What's that in the corner? Ah, oh, more antidote. So yeah, this, this uh, email inbox that I look after, luckily it's an internal one, so it's not one customers are contacting or anything like that but it's sort of just going to get left yes this way so now we push this it moves all the stairs Brain juice. Right. 
got no crow. Bye. Item. Oh, there's a ladder. Cool. But first, tasty bread juice. Splish splash. Have you heard like a storm? It bellows here come a giant. Have you heard like a big giant? Brain juice. Exactly what we needed. And there we have ladder turn here. I've always wanted to try that in real life, but I know I'd just fuck up my hands. Just slide down a ladder and friction burn all my palms away. Right. That's where the problem is. We have a chest. What's in the chest? Anything good? Ooh. Yep, 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 Greg, Maria today. I've got to do the aliens first, but Maria should be straight after. Oh. He also said I was his queen. What the hell's going on here, Greg? Blue Alexa. Basically a shit invisibility potion. Because it doesn't work. Patient queen. <laughs> yes, Greg is our queen. What's in here? Oh, my lamp is on. More brains. And a blue Alexa. Yes, you can, Greg. Don't listen to my news. You sim for as many people as you want. <laughs> yes! Now we can be the blobby head. I think that's all that was in here. So, we'll put them back down the other side. Greg! Look, we even have it. Wait a second. That was the other side. Where the hell am I going? So down here, God. oh, this way, across to the other end, <laughs> to the crazy machine gun man. But 
don't believe it is, Greg. <gasps> Rain. It's a mortal. Right, um. So there's no other way down, so we're gonna have to go down through the rooms now. <laughs> Aha! That's why we need the lips. So what happens if I go out here now? Are there stairs here now? Still not been across that way. Which is the other side of this. I can now get to the places I couldn't find. He's stuck. So you go down to this weird one in a stray jacket and the only useful shield in the entire game so this is the lock shield all it does is block but Artisanal shield crafted with blue glass, originally used to safeguard the leader presiding over a sacred healing church ceremony, later supplied to tomb prospectors, in particular those exploring the labyrinth of Is. Blue is fashioned after a lake and the shield greatly reduces all forms of non-physical damage. You can literally parry spells with this shield. Which I might try and do. I have never managed it. Hi Breener. How are you? Are you enjoying all your gifts on Pokemon? Now no, that both Kelly and my mom are playing it as well. He's on the other side of the wall. Hi, Biff. It is a blob. We have a choice of blob or cage. They are the only acceptable options, so we have blob. Oh, it's these guys freaking out. Ah! Get away. Oh, you're poison. Underground cell key. Beth says one cheered X50. Bits for her blob head XOXO love you, sweetie pie. Thank you, Beth. Everybody loves the blob head. Now I've got to go and give the girl the brain juice. Down this way. Can I survive this fall? Only one way to find out. Yep, easy. Well, well, well. Hello there, Alex.
Oh. oh, there's the rat that fell all the way down from the top. So I've got the underground cell key, which is in the back of the way, isn't it? Go and give this girl in here her brain juice. Please. Hello. I need, I need. Brain juice. I meant to give her. But this. It's gonna open this up really, isn't it? Grab that while I'm here. This is right. We will nip back to the dream and then we'll go down there. This is in the DLC, Alex. I can't remember whether you did the DLC or not, or if you've played the DLC before. Go to GPT. Uh, fish, chips, curry, mushy peas. And the fish is usually either cod or place. See, it's the correct choice. Um, what do you have? Bolt paper. We got plenty of those. Bone blades. Get some more beast pellets. I definitely don't yeah, have enough for a level doer. Very well. There was a chippy near here. Unfortunately, they went bust during COVID, but they did uh, monkfish, and that was amazing. I don't use the rope ones ever. Fixed. Just go out on the balcony. Monkfish is really meaty. It is a kind of flatfish, yeah. useful shit out there. So we head this way. Off here. Make sure there's nothing on this roof. Pew. Can't 
out and still be broke. Cool. Right, I need to kill a few of these nerds. Oh, never mind, they all wake up at the same time and they're all up the back. Let's get this out. Likes a jumbo sausage. It's like most chippy. So yeah, the shield does block a fair amount of her magic damage, but I still prefer just rushing stuff. We have yet to find the favourite chippy round here, unfortunately. But we've we've only been to like two of them. Oh, you're here. The true face of the blood worshipping, beast purging, healing church. But that's not all. You seek the secrets held by the nightmare, do you not? Then here's what you must do. Find the astral clock tower and kill Maria. Okay. She. Go on. She hides. on this corner, what is it? Kin cold blood. Ooh, it hit multiple times. Spell in the game, which I can't use because I'm not using an arcane dog. Right, we go this way. Don't be fooled. A bloodstone chunk. Hi, Dave. I 
it still amazes me some of the places people can get to in this game. Like somebody has to have landed next to that rock there to put a message next to it. Although I am going out for food tomorrow, so. What's in the box? Pulsing damp blood gem. Bloop. And then you drop off onto here. We do have the key for the underground jail cell, so we'll, we'll have a look down here. Put my lamp back on. Start with this one. Tree hunter with cat. From circus and curse and shackle, only the true blade of the church. Got anything else to say? No. Oh well. Give me stuff. Ooh. Is this the weeb stuff? I think it is. Right, back to Blob. What other doors can we open down here now? We got an underground cell key, so I'm assuming. Yeah. One size fits all. Uh, go down there in a sec. Any more of these that can be opened? This one. Oh, sneaky. if this works. <laughs> it does. Right, what do you have? Give me loots, church pick. To the glitch bar, I have not, but I know exactly where it is. I do want to go, definitely. Uh, Charlie has been, Charlie said he's good. Are you dead? You are. Right down here then yeah last time I went in Ma went Manchester he sent me a message and said oh yeah glitch bar is just down the road you should take a look but I was already on my way home uh, can I open I cannot Yeah, there's a, a similar place that I've been to before called the Arcade Club. That place is amazing. I go back there any day. Right. We'll take the 
the lazy way back. Nice. Okay, we, we still need to go to Arcade Club at some point there. She's behind the door. Hello, Blobby. One last time. Will you fetch brain fluid just one last time? Murky, mushy, through the sticky sound in my head. I want Right, where is this last brain fluid going to be? Will brain fluid be? Oh, yeah, there was the room for patience. I wonder if there's one in there. Speedy! Got this one. I don't think it will be inside. Whoa, check out the tentacles. Right. Yeah, so there's no brain fluid in here. You've got it. Dump. So there is the other patient room. Remember how, remember how to get to it. And that also had brain... Well, it had the brain things in it. Where has Speedy gone? I saw you go running up here. Speedy there is a reference to a Dark Souls 2 enemy. Say so Dark Souls 2 when you reach the uh believe the Shaded Woods it's called. There is a single hollow that runs around those woods. Stupid fast holding a torch. And that guy's like a reference to it. Right, where was the other patient room? Went that way. Went down here. We went across to this. And there was the lower level of stuff we could then get to. Which were the things over there on that side. Did it jump? Bugger it, we'll jump it. Yeah, so we 
had this bit that went to here. <laughs> Have you been saving up for that, Greg? Right, that's where the hunter is. Hunter. You know where I found that as well, Manu? It was like a random Reddit post. I was like, I will keep that, that's cute. I have no idea what it's from, or where it's from, or who made it. I just stole it. You can do another one if you get the points, Manu, go for it. I can send you the video file, Manu. I might even be able to s separate the audio from it for you. The yeah, animal freaking out on the other side of the wall. Oh no, that's what this guy is. Now I've just confused myself. been to all the patients rooms and just not realized I don't know <clears throat> yeah I will have a look mate, later man see if I can like rip the audio from it for you it should not be too hard I am becoming an expert at stealing things off the internet Right, I'm just going to have a look outside this door. Because I remember there being, like, a dude outside you talk to at some point. I just can't remember when. 
unless... No, that was it. There it is. I was being dumb. It's the most obvious solution. You hit her for the brain fluid. Here, you can have your own brain fluid back. Bloop, 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 bloop. Ah, uh, my guide, I see your voice. Clearly as it bent. There we go, we got the mil milkweed rune. Right. One last trip to the Hunter's Dream to repair our weapon and then it is boss time. And it is pretty much two bosses in a row so it will be fun. So uh, repair. No. You can go in the bin. There, right. Gems. Do we have any better gems? I doubt it. Oh. Oh no, you're the cursed ones, aren't you? Attack versus... No. Weapon durability. Fuck that. Better gems. It's only going to be the cursed one, isn't it? Yeah, love that. And then. Yeah, the same. About you. Nope, you're as good as it gets. And now. Milkweed rune arm. Ah, we can be the cauliflower. Who needs blobby head when you have cauliflower? Gamino, go on. Very right. well. How much do we need for a level up? Uh, another ten k. Farewell. I want to do the rest of the game as cauliflower because I like cauliflower. It just looks cool. Gammon away. Very well then. Stamina. And then. Gammon away. Go on. Very well let me. I'm not going to get it to 70 until after a boss, boss, bleh, 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 boss fight, so... Oh no, they're max again. Right. So, boss fight time. Looks like I'll get lost in all the elevators and stuff again. So, was what do you think you're doing? Hello, Brainy. <laughs> Thank you, really. <laughs> what? She's dead. <sighs> right. So it was elevator of the old dudes. Was my electric? 
electricity. There. Where are you going to need the electricity? So it's all boots. And then if I remember right, it's... Yay! Time for a chaotic boss. Oh, poor Greg. Alright, this isn't actually going too bad. Until they start doing this thing. Run away! They all come in from a specific direction. Winner! Boss down! Oi! Oi! Oh wait, none of that, you two. Now, light the lamp. Go repair our weapon. And now for Greg's favourite. Sure, it's parries. But I am also not good at parrying the hunters. We shall see. Also, really cool music time. It's up to the Luminwood Garden. So, this. If there's any boss, boss fight I'm going to get stuck on this DLC, it's going to be this one. That's the clock tower key. Bum, bum, bum. 
Also, Greg, did you know there's like four different versions of the next cutscene? There she is. Look, she's already dead. We don't have to do anything. Yeah, I was watching um, it's a YouTuber called Zully the Witch. And she, they do a lot of, like, uh, cut content stuff for Souls games and Bloodborne and things like that. They found, like, four different versions of this cutscene. Also, the uh, the vile blood queen, like the one that you find right at the end of Canehurst, is her sister. They are sisters. Right, Maria time. Oop. I tried to pack that way too late. Ah, oh, we do a decent amount. And she has the old hunter dodge. It's a me. Let's get more badass, Greg. And now even more. Because I pretty much skipped phase two. There we go, got you. Sacrifice a bit of health for an extra parry. So yeah, that was the fight that was going to worry me. But yeah, she is a badass. She starts off just fighting you normally. And then she goes, oh no, we'll add like blood trails to my attacks that hurt you. And then she goes, no, nah, I'm going to go super badass and we're going to add fire to the mix. Now, I've got to remember where this glitched out spot is now. Um, 
It's over this way, isn't it? Um, yeah, this is actually a glitched out part of the game. You're supposed to be able to stand here and just activate this thing. But... Prompts. This is so dumb. She got me down to three. <gasps> Item! That's why it's not working. Right. But it still doesn't work. Oh! We got the rare non glitched version. Sweet. So normally this prompt is somewhere over here. Because it. Yeah, see, look. It's there. It's not supposed to be there. It's supposed to be right here and only here. It's glitched out. Ta da! We might actually finish this DLC today. So, just to put things into perspective for you, we came to the top of the cathedral, out to the big garden, and now we're on top of the city, yeah? You see all the, the nightmare cityscape down there. You can see the nice big lake down there and more of the cityscape. Now, what do you think is on the other side of this watchtower? What would you least likely to be able to find here? Yes, a stinky little fishing village. What a fuck. And, if you look down... You can see the buildings under the water. It's so weird. Like a proper nightmare escape. The weirdest thing is those masts that you can see there. If you go to the other nightmare area in the game, where you fight Amygdala, you can see them in the distance. Hey, it's the crazy priest man. looking man and because I'm wearing this costume he gives me another spell welcome to the fishing islands where everything is more messed up than anywhere else also that dude is hanging in the hunter symbol bold hunter's mark Everything is extra messed up in this village. But it's fish people. <gasps> Not long now, Brina. This is like 
second to last area of the DLC. Not much further to go. And then we have a couple more chalice dungeons to do. Including the really difficult one. Which I might get stuck at for a while because fighting Amagdala with heart health and damage. Oh wait, did I light a lantern? Yeah. It is long. You dead. More gems. There's a lantern around here somewhere. I think I've gone past it. I know there's a lantern around here. Oh, yeah, I have. In fact, walked right past it. There's somebody talking in there, but... Can't see him. <gasps> what? Please see us go. Bart's just in it for the skin trading. I can tell. Uh no spells, please. Right. Time for the only area in the game, apart from Shadows of Yarnum. Where the Shaman Bone Blade is a useful item. To the big shark man. Oh no, I'm at Max. There. Well, well, well. Yeah, Greg knows. basically just more peasant gear. It is not pretty. Ah! Snuck you behind. It is supposed to, Brina. It is. Fishing village itself, anyway, is supposed to be loosely based on Innsmouth. Should 
Greg. It's terrible. Well, I've none of your terrible puns here. Because I have the milkweed rune equipped, so I can be the cauliflower. All it does is net you an extra spell if you talk to the guy at the beginning of this area. But I also like the freaky look of it. And cauliflower man. You all dead. What is this item? Fire jab. Something I will not be using. Right. Now for the bit where I'm probably going to die. Where is... Need to get you equipped. At least I can buy more bone blades if I need to. So it's this dude with his anchor. Where's his friend? Oh yeah, you're hanging from the ceiling, aren't you? Damn it. As you can see, they do a fair bit of damage to each other. Now I get the Rakuyo, which is Lady Maria's weapon. Hunter weapon wielded by Lady Maria of the Astral Clock Tower. Trick sword originated in the same country as the Kanehurst Chicago. Only this sword fields off not blood, but instead demands great dexterity. So yeah, this one she eventually just threw in this well. <gasps> I would definitely use a raccoon as a weapon though. Swing it round by the tail and throw it at people. But yeah, that's the only other place the uh, Shaman Bone Blade is really useful. Fish dog. It's a fish dog. Oh, 
There used to be a Raccoon's Kids TV show in the UK. Like a cartoon. It was pretty much just DuckTales, but with raccoons. I remember watching it when I was a kid. There was a TV show called Raccoons. Ah, that big shark man, stop it. Right, the spellcaster, dealt with. Down backstab already. Oh, turning at the very last second. actual last area. We're heading down to that big weird looking thing over there. Uh, I am working tomorrow Kelly. Nine till four but I'm working from home and then I'm off. Right. We have Oh no! He looks messed up. Who are you? I'm afraid I've made a book. Yeah, sense. vacation time. Oh, I can hear the bell now. The beast hide assassin. He's after me. Again. And again. It never ends. you to do something. This village is the true secret. Testament to <laughs> old sin. All the Dave Cuddles. It feeds this hunter's nightmare. Please. Bring to an end the horror. So our forefathers sin. We hunters cannot bear their weight forever. So yeah, apparently the old hunters did something really bad. It just is And he dead. But we get his weapon. Which I can't use. And it's called Simon's Bow Blade, and it is literally a sword that turns into a bow. And he gave us the underground cell key. Which we'll go and open. Uh 
after we've spent some of this hard-earned blood on another level. Yeah, yeah, I am aware, Gammon awaits. But I want that tasty endurance. Boop. Boop. this room back off because I only wanted it on for the talking to the dude so we'll get beast or we will go back to blobby head so now we're going to go back to the church and find that um, underground cell that we didn't open before so we need to go to... Corpse Pile is closest. <laughs> Bonner. Corpse pile up here. I hear the bell ringing. <gasps> I'm getting invaded. I really like nuts. Someone is going to clip it. Right. Stop that. I saw Kelly, did not look happy. Right. You got beat. Let's go down here. Let's open the door. There he is. Who's here? Well, are you going to kill me? After all, you died killing me. As if to right your wrongs. Nah, not yet. What is it? Or perhaps beg my forgiveness. Well, leave on. <laughs> right, that's him sorted. He's gonna sit there ringing his bell and invade us a few more times. And I will try and kick his ass. Very angry little bird. Right. Back to the fishing hamlet. Thoreau's Marinus is a really weird weapon. It's basically a super soaker. Right, uh, a lantern is on. We go in this way. So we've got. Okay, it doesn't open from this side, so you're a shortcut. Other way. Uh, 
out and around a bit. Onto the roof. There's the bell ringing. Means he's coming in again. I think he's on the other side of this bridge. Yeah, he is. Macaroons! No, the coconut ones are the good ones. Let me shoot you more. Anything to stop you using stupid caution. There. You got his arms. Right. Weird old priest now. What's this way? fish people. Macaron. Yeah, because macaroons are the coconut ones and macarons are the... Is it almond? They made from almond pot, like almond ground, something like that, almond flour. You're not going to invade again, are you? You are. You dick. There. Fight the fishmen's again. Yeah, you probably would. Hi Tom, how are you? I am nearing the end. I beat up Greg's waifu. I am doing better than I expected. one between shots and yeah, we may even finish this DLC today depending upon how lost I get making my way through this village I'm not good with directions I see a ladder it was the door that's the shortcut over here this door. It is this door. Perfect. Right. <laughs> Old man. <laughs> okay. Sometimes I think Greg might be losing his hair because of us. Get a full head of hair before he started streaming. Snail women. Now 
what, what is Tom doing his next uh, stupid land stream then? <laughs> Greg had enough for another one. That's what I'm going to do. <laughs> do you know what we should get? Manu, remember the... Christmas hat that you had that Mellow liked to attack. We should get Greg one of those. And because we bought it him, he'll have to wear it. It's a great idea. Now you another chunk. Turn on a blood rock here somewhere. Aha, right, this leads to the boss. I remember now. So there is another shot to mark. And another invasion. This could be over here, isn't he? No. Oh, he comes in behind us. You're a silly man, Braidor. Stand there stabbing yourself. And I stole his pants. Right, we're a max on bullets. Right, around here somewhere that is. Castro. before I get attacked because I have full call out. There. I did the dumb thing but it worked. But it wasn't dumb. Down the drop off we go. Bloop. What we got here, we got tunnel. I can hear a lantern down that way. This is the boss entrance. It's not Tom, it's Tom, it's real. I saw it happen, it's real. the switch or the lever. Oh, we nip down here first. What's here? Another cursed gem. Yeah, it's not photoshopped. It's what Greg actually thinks of us. I saw it happen. This is going to be shortcut back up, isn't it? It's got to be. Yep, yep, yep. Sweet. Open sea gate. 
Now we'll go down the mysterious tunnel. And after that we've got the rest of the village to fight our way through. So, this way. Oh, there's one of you down here, isn't there? Right. More than one of you down here. Gem we won't be using because it can't stand cursed gems. What have we got there? No. Tempering damp blood gem might be useful. Ah, uh, what's over this way? What we got more oh, fish ladies. Lightning man. Right, we'll go sort him out first. Stop that, you. Get back here. Say get back. Is there another one? There is. No, no, Marie. Have good sleeps and rest and stuff. Blood rot. Yes. Upgrade our guns are full. Fulls. Oh, fulls is the one where you take more damage, isn't it? I'm pretty sure. Right, we've got a max upgrade for our gun now. We'll go and do that next time we pop back to the dream. Yeah, bullets are max. Kill more snail girls. Right, that's this bit cleared out. So we're going to head back up to Shortcut. Shortcut's this way. We need to head back to the dream. And then we have the village to explore, and then the boss. Or gems as well. I'm hoping. So, first of all, fortify. Hunter's pistol times 10. You go in there. Don't really need the torch. Don't need the shield. Right, let's check these gems out that I picked up. Get anything better than what I got in it? I know one of them was a cursed gem, so I might just ignore it. But so cursed hampering, yeah, the same. Your durability down, so we're not using you. Hack versus kin down. No, we don't want those in at the moment. So this last one, we might wanna swap out. 
actually you're at 19 different percent more. So yeah, that's gonna offset the rest of it. And then you I don't think we've got anything better for the gun, have we? No. Can we get a level? Uh, maybe if I pop some blood. We got left. Yeah, we can get one. At least. Tiny bit of damage increase. Right, we're gonna go and explore the village now. And then it is boss time. Because the village has some useful stuff in it. So, lighthouse hut. fight more fish men and fish dogs and fight Braidor again because he's going to show up everywhere it's like a villain of the week bum, 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 bum. so the bell rings over here, he stabs himself and then we just wail on him. Oi! I said you could escape. Ow! The weapon does a lot. There. So, kill this guy. I want him. Electrocuting me and stuff while I'm trying to run round. Fell off. While I'm trying to run round, and then we have village to explore. Fish dogs, more fish man, more fish priest. Whoop, I'll fill the gap. Fight time it is then. Ow! just outside that door. So we've not got that much to do. We've got the shortcut to the boss. We've just got this little village to do. And then the boss. And then next stream I can bounce my head off that evil chalice dungeon. Well, I'll 
try not to fall through the gap this time so I can actually surprise stuff. There. You. You. Brick to bridge. Trap, aren't you? Right, so we'll go out this way instead. We got you down there, right? Um, time to use some of these molotovs and stuff I've been hoarding. Got you. I'm dealt with. Now I can go down the gap and I should be vaguely safe. Vaguely. He must have gone up chasing me. Now. Yeah, he must have gone up the ladder to chase me and then come back down when I dropped down. Into the maze. It's up here. Anything? Nothing about. Ah, another invasion. That's what's up here. Come on, stab yourself. And let me trap you against the wall. So we've got hands, head, gloves, legs. That's everything, isn't it? Yeah, hands, head, gloves, legs. So, we can go back and murder in there. Uh, we got everything down here? We have. We've got all his invasions. We've got all the items. We'll go murder Braidor himself, and then we'll do the boss. Because Braidor needs a murdering. So back this way. Back up the ladder, I'm guessing. There's nothing else out this way, is there? Go. Let's 
So it's the corpse heap that we have to go back to, the corpse pile. Oh, we'll go and kick Braidor's ass himself. gems but I don't think we got any Top up on blood vials and stuff, and we'll go kill Braidor and then go for the boss. Oh, yeah, I can just buy fire paper and bolt paper, can I? Oh well, poisoned knives it is. To the corpse pile. beat up Braidor in his cell. And then we'll start our fights against the big bad of the DLC. So I say the big bad, it's not really. Right, you're gonna invade again, aren't you? Yeah, so Go down here to where he actually is. Yeah, you dick. Changes. Such is the nature of man. Yeah, fucked. And we get his weapon. Right, now we can go and do the boss. Be prepared for lots more screaming. Screaming is the theme of Bloodborne bosses, and this one has a lot more than pretty much anything else. Huts. We're gonna go down in the well. We're gonna go past all the praying dudes. And we're gonna watch a fun cutscene. And I will equip. This while I remember. Praying ones were as old. Praying ones. Not that way. This way. Yeah, they're all there. They're all praying. And they are worth zero blood. In fact, rolling into them is enough to kill them. extra horrific end bit to the boss. Right, boss time it is. Let's go have a look at the big squishy thing. Be prepared for lots more screaming.
Look at it, it's beautiful. way buddy I know we can fight out on this water so that's what we're gonna do not happy. Yeah, he's got long combos. That was like a six, seven hit combo. I thought he was done and he wasn't. And now I need to remember to do the Dark Souls thing and send the lift back up after I've gone down. He can also be parried, but I have never been any good at it. Not with him anyway. This way. Roll through all the screamers. Honestly thought I might get a second back stuff then. <laughs>
one open. Not that far to go. I know you're unhappy. I'm sorry. He's only a baby orphan. He didn't deserve it. But we got the tentacle weapon. Oz Parasite is the tentacle weapon. I know you've got this weird thing. And yeah, that's the DLC done. Are we back? Are we back? yet you know BS yeah it just literally through the cutscene it just said OBS disconnected reconnecting so I thought knows what happened there but what will do this is the DLC all done, by the way. The only thing we have left now are the other Chalice Dungeons and the last two bosses. So we need 70 for another level. Where is my blood at? Boom. Gammon awaits you. Very well, let Right. So I'm gonna do one attempt against the Chalice Dungeon of Mignola. See how it goes. And then I will go in search of food and stuff. Um, just buy these. Spike. Spike gets fake first. Oh yeah, I want to use the... I actually want to use the little stormer. Spike gets fake first. So we will use these for it. There. So, into the chalice dungeon. Let's see if I can't beat Amygdala. How are you doing, Spike? You got in just as uh just as I finished the DLC. And it's okay, Dave, I've been making all the boss fights into highlights. So I will post it so you can go back and watch it. Bam, 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 bam. So we go straight through. We're now on half health, half damage. Hello, Amygdala. <laughs> Headbutt. <laughs> One and a half root hour run, so it came off. Well done, Spike. That's how you play that game. I hope you got some speeding tickets, some crashes, 
some binds for not having your headlights on. Right, he did it again. Stupid amygdala. <gasps> teach Archie to sing it, that'd be awesome. I need to remember how to dodge that first attack again, because it's still enough to one-shot me. Despite having all these levels and stuff. That works. Made him angry. His arms.
I got him under halfway, that's alright. So we'll do him next stream. Oh. Yeah, that's me done for today. We will go and beat up Amygdala next time. No. Is he still live? Just for comedy value. Bum, 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 bum. When my internet speeds up. <sighs> Thank you for coming, everybody. Yeah, so we're gonna go on. I know you pissed by. So, thank you for watching everybody, thank you for the bits, and for all the happy time redeems, and I am glad we got the DLC done. Next time I can just bounce my face off the, off amygdala for a while. So, I will see you all soon everybody, bye bye, bye bye.